site setup. Five bedroom house that we're pricing does require us to allow for site setup. By default, the site setup is closed. We open it by ticking this box. This section contains blue and yellow boxes. Due to the nature of site setup, our judgment will be required. Site clearance and disposal is dealt with first. If there is any demolition, we may want to allow for a handheld breaker or a generator. Just enter the number of days the item will be required into the blue boxes that are located in the quantity column. A further blue or pre-filled yellow box will appear in the hours column. Enter or adjust the number of hours that the item is going to be used for and the labour costs will be calculated based on this. If a different plant item is needed, we can change the default by using the yellow drop-down menu like this. Or, if we see a red question mark, we can alter the item in the picture. Waste Disposal has a thumbnail picture. We'll see thumbnail pictures throughout the pricing sheet. They're interactive like the red question marks. If required, the method of waste disposal can be changed like this. The other elements of site setup are dealt with in the second section. If any protective items, like polythene or plyboard are needed, enter the quantity required into the blue box. We can adjust the item by using the drop-down menu. If a dry silo is needed, enter the number of weeks it will be required. When a dry silo is entered here, it automatically triggers the rest of the pricing sheet to allow for this. The calculations in the ground floor and walls will switch to a dry silo mix, rather than a sand and cement mortar mix. Click the question mark for further details. Any temporary buildings or safety fencing can be factored into our quote. Just enter the quantity of weeks and any hours associated with it. We can change any of the default descriptions in the drop-downs, but if we need to allow for an additional item or items within the site setup, then we can add an extra row by clicking here. The total for this section can be viewed here.